juice. Ooh. <laughs> you feeling all right? Montreal smoked meat. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Go all right. It. So these are the... Are they the... Oh, they do have the thing here, but it doesn't it doesn't say save us a flavor. That's what it's called, right? No, do us, do us a flavor. flavor. It says okay. that. <laughs> okay, I didn't see it earlier, okay? These are the United States do us a flavor flavors. And we've got this one is Southern Biscuits and Gravy. And then... Hold on. Well, I'm going to the looks disgusting. It does not look like gravy. It looks like Alfredo sauce. It looks like mushroom soup. Then we got... Yeah, it does. On a biscuit. It's got the chunks, too. On a biscuit. Yeah. West Coast truffle fries, which I'm looking forward to tasting. They're wavies. Then we got our kettle cooked Greek town gyro. Gyro. <laughs> And the New York Reuben. I love Reubens. I'm not looking forward to this after the Montreal smoked meat, though. Oh, no. Now, I, I am surprised that they didn't do, like, a regional, like, Northwest, yeah. or Southwest, or, or anything, really. Um, Cut it up in, according to the uh, risk regions. <laughs> there's only, like, there's Southern, there's West Coast... There's New York, and then there's Greek Town, which doesn't seem to fit in there. Open the bag. Okay. Open the bag! Open the bag! What's in the bag? What's in the box? What's in the bag? It's creepy chips. Okay. Mm. Kinda... Okay, I'm scared. It smells... Familiar. It smells like the chicken one, doesn't it? It smells like chicken gravy. Yeah, it probably is. Alright, take one. And even chicken gravy is white. Mmm! Yeah, like this the... was the one I was scared of. It's almost like there's a little bit of. I never had the gravy and the biscuits. That's good. That's pretty good. I like that some biscuits and gravy seasoning. They're so nondescript in the things that they can't disclose. Because if they did, people would steal everything from them. Oh, wow. Yeah. And buttermilk. Hmm. And cream. Ooh. More paprika. Onion I got powder. The paprika. Sour cream. I mean, in all honesty, if you had asked me to list what I thought was in there, paprika, sour cream, and onion powder were going to be listed. Yeah. That was kind of... Eat it. Eat it. And let's move on. Those are good. Not bad, actually. I, these ones are the ones I was most scared of. Alright, next is the West Coast Truffle Fries. Truffle Fries. I wonder if it's actually going to taste like truffle oil, I think it is. Truffle oil. Truffle oil. Yeah. Mmm. Mmm. Get away. It smells a little like seafood. Yeah. Like seaweed. Duck fat, chicken fat. What? Duck fat and chicken fat. What? I guess because duck goes with truffle. Man, vegans and vegetarians got it hard. That's just in mm. chips. You can taste the garlic. Okay. You can definitely taste the garlic. Whoa. I like that. I don't know if I'd be able to eat a ton of them, but... I don't eat garlic regularly. It gives me, like, a slight taste of kind of like garlic bread, mm -hmm. but not. Mm. You know what? I used to eat the, gar the cheesy garlic bread lays, like... Mm -hmm. Bag after bag after bag. Mm -hmm. This is what they taste like. So they taste like garlic bread. Yeah. They taste like the garlic bread flavor. Lays, don't reuse your flavor mixes. Wow. <laughs> Next is the Greek what? town. What? Heroes can fly, can't they? The Greek town. Hero. Gyro. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
I don't like that smell. Uh-huh. Okay, okay. I can't smell anything. It doesn't anything. smell, it doesn't smell as bad outside of the bag. I can't smell anything. Maybe it's just... Is it just meat? It smells like a little bit like that meat and the pita, but... Mm. Oh my god, I smelled it so hard the bag mm. sucked in. I can taste pita. Mm -hmm. I can taste warm tzatziki sauce. Oh, and these are kettle cooked too. I like the crunch on kettle. Oh, cook. <laughs> you get you get like dry warm tzatziki <laughs> flavoring, right? Yeah. Rather than, like, That's pepper. a problem because they're they're pepper or tomato or something like that. They're kettle cooked, so they're drier. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. I mean, I'll eat them. It reminds oh, me of a gyro. It's not good. It does a good job of reminding me of a gyro. Hero. Um. Moving on. Okay, I'm gonna taste like fish. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> uh, I'm done with that one. Mm, that's not a good mix. Um, the New York Reuben, which after that Montreal smoked meat, I am scared. If you haven't seen, I like Reubens. They better not butcher this. Yeah, but if you haven't seen, we tried the Canadian chips, and the Montreal smoked meat was the Canadian. Um, red. red meat flavor, I guess. It was in a and, red bag. Uh, <laughs> it was awful. That doesn't smell bad. I can smell. I smell like sauerkraut or something like that. Yeah. Raw and sauerkraut. Mm. See, I can't mm. have. I can't have a Reuben. I like that. That's good. I can taste the Russian dressing. <laughs> I get a bit of the meat. You don't want. Yeah, the onion. Mm -mm. Uh, onion. Sauerkraut, whatever. No oh, onion and sauerkraut. Oh, it's pickled cabbage. Oh, that's really strong. Like, I understand why you would like it. It tastes like it. It's so good. I'm happy. Uh, they did it right, but it's not my thing. <coughs> I think this is gonna be perfect. Now, to start, this is my one. Okay. Put the Reuben first, and the second. Okay. I think you're gonna put the Reuben first, though. Let's see what the fuck the is. What the fell is like? Here we go. This for me. You are right. This is my my life. This for me was number three because it tastes almost identical to an existing flavor that they have. So it's not impressive. Like I guess maybe that's what those taste like. Tastes like gar garlic parmesan fries, which tastes like their cheesy garlic bread. That's what these taste like: garlic parmesan fries. I don't get the truffle. It probably didn't to the expense. Well, we've never had <laughs> truffle fries, so we don't know. Small quantities. I don't know. Okay. Really? <laughs> you don't like the biscuits and gravy? I love the biscuits and gravy, but these just grow on me with every one I bite. Yeah, no. All right. Well. Now that that's settled. Now that that's settled. No! No, Ow. Oh. What? I, what am I supposed to do? Whatever. So what's our agreement? Which are the best? These three are the best. So, out of the United States, uh, do us a flavor challenge or whatever that Lay's does now. Yeah. Go ahead and dance. <laughs> Didn't mean literally. Um, out of the United States flavors of the Do Us a Flavor Lays event that they did last year and now this year again, I would say that, or we would have to agree, that the best flavors are actually three flavors. The Reuben, tastes like a Reuben. Dry like a chip. It tastes like a ruby. You can't have ruby. I know, but I don't agree. You think it's good. Yeah, but it tastes like a ruby. Yeah. You just don't like ruby. Yeah. Like the West Coast truffle fries, which are fantastic, and I know I said that they kind of taste like the um, existing cheesy garlic bread fr uh, flavor, but the more you eat, the more you can tell that there is a difference. And the Southern biscuits and gravy. 
was number, f well, the third of the best. Um, I don't know if we can really put these in any order of which is better than the other. It comes to personal preference. But the gyro, just not good. Awful. It tastes like dried tzatziki powder. 